Grade 8 math number 3.3a relate a unit rate to a slope. A rate is a comparison of two quantities that have different units, like miles and hours, or gallons and minutes. A unit rate is a type of rate that has a second quantity that is only one unit, miles for each hour, like miles per hour. We can find the slope of a line by finding the constant rate of change of points on the line. We can find a unit rate as the rise divided by the run from the slope of the line. So we know our slope formula from our previous videos, and we know that the slope is m, and we find it by finding the change in the y values from the y coordinates of y2 take away y1, and the change in x values of the x coordinates, x2 minus x1, for two points on a slope. So the slope of a line is a ratio, it's a fraction of the change between the two y values, the rise for a segment of the graph, to the corresponding change in two x values, the run. So Emma placed a rain gauge in her garden as a big rainstorm began on Monday, and after the rain stopped, the gauge had collected six inches of rain. She made a graph to represent the rainfall per day. So here's her graph, and this is the time in days, and this is the rain in inches. And we can see at one day there was three inches, and at two days there were six inches. So we find the slope of the graph using the points 1 and 3. Here's x is 1 and y is 3. And we have 2 and 6. x is on the 2, and the y is on the 6. See? Now what we have to do is have y2 minus y1, which would be 6 minus 3, and x2 minus x1, that's 2 minus 1, and we get 3 over 1, 3 divided by 1. So the slope m is 3. It rained 3 inches per day. The unit rate is 3 inches per day. Now, if we look at the direction of the line, it's heading up to the right, we can see the slope is going to be a positive number. And if we look at the origin right here, 0, 0, and the first point right here, 1, 3, where the x and y intercept each other for the first time, see? This is the first time that they intercept each other right here at this point. We can see the unit rate of change for one day is 3 inches. So just by comparing this origin right here to this first intersection right here, we can see it's 1 to 3. See? We can also see the rise is a 1, 2, 3 over a run of 1. See that? That's our 3 over 1. So that's how we relate a unit rate to a slope. That wasn't that difficult, was it? We're going to talk about graphing proportional relationships in the next video, and I'll see you there. Don't forget to hit the like button if this was helpful, and don't forget I can post these to Twitter as study guides for you that you can print or save in a file, okay? All the whiteboards, all right? I'll see you next video. Bye.